And see this, Kentucky's Democratic candidate, Allison Lundergan Grimes, who is kind of inching up in the polls in an editorial board interview, even refused to answer who she voted for in the last two presidential elections. Did you vote for President Obama, 2008-2012? You know, this election uh, it isn't about the president. It's about know, making sure we him? put Kentuckians back to work. Did you and vote for him? I, I was actually in a way to delegate for Hillary Clinton, and I, I think that Kentuckians know I'm a Clinton Democrat uh, through and through. I, I respect the sanctity of the ballot box, and I know that the members of this editorial board do as well. So you're not going to answer? Again, I don't think that the, the president is on the ballot uh, as much as Mitch McConnell might want him to be. Uh, it's my name. I mean, come on. <laughs> Just tell people who you voted for. Al Hunt, I had an opponent uh, in 94 that <laughs> would not answer that question. And he, w he, wouldn't, he wouldn't tell me. I was like, did you vote, did you vote for... You know, did you vote for Bill Clinton or not? This is a simple question. Well, I didn't. Blah, blah, blah. And it just makes him look foolish. So, of course, I just kept pounding away at him. Just say it. We all know she voted for Barack Obama. It just, uh, a Democrat in that position is in an awful position. It's not hard. Well, yeah, Joe, you're right, and, and it's sophomoric. Everybody knows she did. She can simply say, I voted for Barack Obama, but let me tell you, it's about the future. I'm disappointed in the president. He's against coal, whatever she wants to say. <laughs> right. But to duck it like that is just oh, really, really an amateur. And I'll tell you something, if, if, if she was in a primary, she wouldn't have said that right of now. Of course not. Well, and, you know, Mika, that... That, uh, Mika, that's a perfect thing to say. What you, what you say is, you go, yeah, I voted against Barack Obama. And like a lot of people in Kentucky and a lot of people across America, I'm really disappointed in him. I didn't think he was going to wage a war against coal workers in Kentucky. I didn't think. And then just add to there. And then suddenly they're like, mm. okay, wow, okay, yeah. Well, she admits she voted for him. And she's disappointed so she can actually move. That, that was... It's it just an embarrassment. And then you can go right on to the Republican. I also watched the, uh, Joe's actually yeah. right.